We're growing back a heart even as we speak. I'm still here. And I've got my hands going back. <laughs> so it's there. We in a weird trippy place? Done a map, so cutscene. How did I get here? God, freezing. You've got shit in my body. Oh, hi, Evelyn. How are you here? You're dead. But the mold in us. I mean, Miranda. She. To other hearts, yes. No. I still have to save Rose. <laughs> it wasn't Miranda. You were always dead. What are you saying? I can still... <sighs> yeah, we're going to have to make a big heroic final sacrifice as... Miranda didn't kill you. As Ethan. So we've been dead all along. But we just keep on reattaching limbs and it's fine. Shouldn't be walking. Screw you! What, what am I? You're a zombie. I, 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 I did all that. Rose. Yeah. I... Still gonna come and save you. So is this how yeah, Mia and dead. Mia and dead. Ethan were able to have a kid? <laughs> I will save Rose. Hmm. I'll save you, cute baby, no matter what. At last, he awakes. Oh, hi, Duke. Where am I? My carriage, Ethan. 
You were having a nightmare. Or were we? Duke? Your battle with Heisenberg was a sight to see. But to think Miranda would show herself. How long have I been out? Not long till dawn. Duke, I need a favor. Take me to Miranda. I assumed as much and I'm already on the way. You're a good egg, Duke. You should arrive shortly. Thank you. <laughs> but Ethan, are you sure of this? Your body is, well, falling apart. <sighs> yes. Foolish of me to ask. Speaking of foolish questions, who or what are you? <laughs> Even I can't quite answer that. Interesting. We're here. So not an experiment? I owe you one. Something else. Mr. Winters, I'm afraid you can't return to your old world any longer. Are you ready? Yep. Yeah. I have to be. So we're gonna save <coughs> Mia and Rose. Go. Oh, we've got the uh, the map back. And we can still shop. Now than ever before. Oh, the assemblage of life and Cha ching I can feel Lord Heisenberg's essence through it. Well, they're both for the handgun. That's really expensive. Um. Ah, seems you have no room. Oh. No. This may be our last me. Please be well. Thanks. Hmm. As you wish. Aha! Choose wisely. Your life may depend on it. Never did find any more of that stuff. Bonne chance. Some bits and pieces left around. I mean, get Rose back from Miranda. So where we're heading to the ceremony site, I guess. Everywhere else is going to be blocked off. Yes. Yeah. Um Here goes then. There was nowhere that we could save our game, was there no? This is uh, a slow walk section.
I'm very aware of the fact that this is just a waste of ammo section. I gotta keep going. Ew. My beautiful daughter, come to me. If, is that you? Oh, how I've missed you. How would you even know? What? Oh, that's Rose. My power is leaving me. Rose! <sighs> Miranda! Interesting. Your body certainly isn't normal. Well, no. Give Rose to me. Now! You will see. Once I kill you properly, everything... Get her now! Yoink! Let go! I have spent a lifetime creating this moment. And you try to take it away from me. I will take what is due. My desires will be fulfilled! No. Rose is mine! Yes. Oh. You fulfilled your purpose, Mr. Winters. You disposed of my false children and awakened the glorious Megamice. Oops. Now, please do not worry, the little Rose. I assure you, I'll provide her with true happiness. So now you can die peacefully. Do not let him get away. Oh. I think I want to hide behind these. You understand the level of parent to a child. How can you deny me? Why the hell can't you realize? Rose is my goddamn kid, not yours. You won't eat me. This is I've never seen a human live without a heart. Are you sure you're not? Well, I mean, technically. The Megamycete saved me from the pits of despair. It granted me this splendid power. Yeah, right. All it's done is drive you nuts. Uh, I'm probably going to need to heal in a second. After all, everyone dies. Oh. Okay. Uh, we've got a heal. <laughs> oh, great mega mice. Hear my prayer. Uh oh. She's doing a thing again. No, that's a. It's gone dark. Now, Mr. Winters, I think it's time you left things in my house. Oh, rest now. The hell I will. I will take back my daughter! <laughs> it's gonna work, Murga's wet nurse. Die, 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 die. If I combine Rose with a Mega Mice, 
My daughter will be made manifest at last! I've waited a century. A century! All for this day! That's not doing anything, is it? Why do you persist in this place? I won't die because I can't. How about this? <laughs> the villagers, those four witches, they could do nothing to assuage my years of loneliness. Ever think the problem might be you, Miranda? <laughs> You're not capable of real love. Such vitality. Ow. I shall put you to rest. For my dog. Oh dear. You won't eat. Ouch. I don't think I'm but you know. Uh let's Your time is up! Now die! I will see my hopes for good. Must I'm not very good at it. There's nothing. Oh. I shall finish this. You still Not really saying a lot during this fight, am I? Oh, I'm out of uh, shotgun ammo, apparently. Here I come. To save the day! Oh! This is how you end With my knife! I think we've got her. My daughter! My Ava! No Ava for you.
One assumes she's not going to leave a crystal ball. Ah, hello. Baby. Rose. Hi, Rosie. Oop. <laughs> Magnetize her. It's, it's all right, Rose. It's all right. This is the last time you're going to see her. Yeah. Oh, Daddy. Ethan. Ethan. Come on, Ethan. Come on, Ethan. Wake up. He's. He's got. Uh oh. Chris. Ethan. You did it. It's finished. I think we've finished each other. Ethan. We gotta move. Wow, pretty. Still got the uh, keep moving, Ethan. There's a bomb in that thing that'll blow this whole village sky high. Hey, look at me. When I hit this trigger, we can't be anywhere near it. Ah, damn it. Mia's waiting for you. She's alive, you hear me? She's alive. alive. Mia. I'm so sorry. I love you. Keep Rose safe. Hey, hey. Hey. Can you tell yourself? He can't. It's not that much further. over her teach her to be strong yeah i told you big heroic God damn. yoink yo chris i like how they're very deliberately not showing um ethan's face for all of this It's very, very deliberate. Of course, Rose is still going to be like super powerful, maybe. Ethan be gone. Get moving. We have to get clear. No, we can't go. Not without my husband. Mia, sit down and strap in. Not before you tell me where Ethan is. I know he wouldn't abandon us. Nope. Tell me what's going on. Where? There. <laughs> Ooh, 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 ooh. That was a lot of explosive. What was that? I told you to sit down. <gasps> Where is he? Chris, what have you done? He's gone. I tried. He stayed so we could all escape. I'm sorry. Chris does not have a good track record. You need to see this. BSAA didn't send soldiers. This is a bioweapon. The hell were they thinking? Orders, Captain. 
Oh. Pick up the rest of the squad. Plot a course for BSAA Europe HQ. BSAA are the people that took over hunting down Umbrella. Someone's got to be. Weren't they? I forget. Oh. Hehe. <laughs> Well, village. It's just turned midnight. <laughs> I wasn't gonna stay up this late. Village of Shadows. Capcom presents. Oh, we've got a song version of this. This is going to get copyright struck because it, stuff like this always does in Capcom videos. Um, yeah, th this cinematic I really, really liked. I'd actually really like to see a game in this style. There probably is one. That was uh, that was a good game. Really enjoyed that. There were a lot of people that said the remake of Resident Evil 3 was a little bit of a a short cop out experience. There were too many changes and so on and so forth, too short, etc., etc. I really enjoyed the Resident Evil 3 remake and I've played it two, three times now, something like that. Um, I've only played seven once, but it was it left a really strong impression on me. I think this is all round a better game. It's it, it the pacing of the final section in the factory may have been a little bit slow in comparison to the other areas. I don't know. It'll be interesting to see when I've edited the footage together how many episodes I had in the the castle versus how many I had in the factory because they seem to have been of comparable length. The the reservoir was shorter and the creepy dollhouse was terrifying, frankly, and uh, should never be in a game ever again. But I really liked the fact that we got to play a section it's as Chris. In turn, is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. Her parents, though, had searched all day and at last arrived. With rampant rage, father fought the witch, while mother's loving touch shattered the dark enchantment. But the witch was strong, and father yelled, Save our daughter! So mother bore their child to safety as the forest was consumed. So it's yeah. So this is the end of the story that we didn't the see. The forest is a grim reminder of father's sacrifice. To this day, any child who stares too long it looks into like an the as well. wasteland will be haunted by nightmares of getting lost while picking berries. And yeah, I liked that we got the end into that because of course. It was really obvious right at the start when it drew us out of that cinematic. It was obvious that the story that Mia was telling Rose wasn't done. Because that wasn't Mia. That was Miranda. And had potentially been Miranda for quite some time. So all of that stuff about going completely native, that was foreshadowing. Like, really, really subtle foreshadowing. Because now I think about it. that That's the point of foreshadowing. It's supposed to be that hint that when you look back at it, it's like, oh, that links forwards. That's what foreshadowing is. It's, foreshadowing has to have that payoff where you can look back and say, you know, spot the links. That's, that's good writing, frankly. Um... the the revelation that ethan was dead all along is an interesting one 
And obviously it bears kind of logic-based questions like how could they have had kids, etc., etc. But Mia's been was completely infected by the mold as well. Um so uh, you know, it was DNA altering, especially the version that they had injected with them. I kind of want to go back and watch my Resi 7 videos now. Or maybe play the game again. Because I think I only played it once. So is this Is this moment? No, I, d I don't know. I'm I'm trying to figure out what the um. What the kind of wood carvings are in relation to. It's, it's more of that storybook. Yeah, really, really good storytelling. I think the only bits that I was a little bit disappointed in were some of the boss fights were a little bit too long. The fish one, especially. Especially in comparison to the Heisenberg one, which which felt quite short. Um, ew. Oh, is this the Spanish flu stuff? Um, and the fact that you couldn't, couldn't get back into the castle. I really wanted to be able to explore the castle without... Uh, the the Domitresks breathing down our necks. I mean, we could we could have spent more time there, realistically. Um, but yeah, the, the, there were a few things that I know I missed that I would have liked to, you know, I'd have liked to go back to the rooftops, for example. Um, but I guess I'll get them on a, a second playthrough because, of course, after this, there will be, you know, challenge modes and stuff unlocked where you can probably get some super broken weapons, uh, some infinite ammo ones, and so on and so forth. But yeah, what I'm interested in now, and keep in mind that I've not played, well, I haven't played 4, 5, and 6 of Resident Evil, and I can't... That Chris's Chris's part in seven was so minor towards the end that the BSAA stuff, I can't really remember what it is, but I thought they were the anti bioweapon task force or something. Weren't they tasked with um cleaning up in a post umbrella world? I thought that was the point of them. So the fact that they have sent bioweapons in shows that maybe they've had um, a hydra moment where they've been growing inside where uh, umbrella has been growing inside i really liked incidentally just on that thought the link to spencer the spencer mansion the one of the founders of umbrella and the kind of circular narrative for how they got hold of the the Evelyn stuff in the first place and, and used that at the Baker estate. It was... I think it's a really well put together story. Whether it was planned this way from the start, I don't know. But it might well have been there were enough kind of narrative kind of threads being stretched between the two that I suspect they probably had an idea for where they might want to go with eight from seven, if seven did well, which of course it did, I think. It was a little bit more cult, but I think the VR version of it helped as well. Yeah. Capcom. After credit scene? After credit scene. After credit scene? Rose? Do you think the little boy will be able to touch the moon? Not that he can touch the moon, it's too far away. Wait, what if he has a rocket ship? Uh, 
Have we got a flash okay. forward? Then you can touch it, but it'd be very, very cold. You were being silly. She's got her dad's jacket on. <laughs> Going to visit his grave. Cemetery. Yeah, it's going to go and read him the story, Ethan Winters. Hey, Dad. Happy birthday. Sorry I missed last week. I have a lot of tests coming up. You know how it is. <laughs> Damn devil. Uh oh. Duty calls. I love you. Oh. Setting up for a new protagonist yeah. for the series? Where else? The day of all days. <clears throat> we have a situation. You're needed, <laughs> Evelyn. Don't you ever call me that again. Whoa. Oh, it's just a joke, Rose. I can show you things even Chris doesn't know I can do. We have a clear shot. Stand down. I can handle it. She's just a kid. She is not just a kid, though, is she? Together, Rose. He strikes me as a Wesker-like. You're a lot like him, you know. I know. She's under constant surveillance, though, by the sound of it. Really interested to see what they're setting up with this. Boom. The father's story is now done. Great dad, best dad ever. Difficulty standard, 11 hours, 19 minutes and 13 seconds. I assume those were for Finish the sewer on at least casual difficulty. And at least standard difficulty. Difficulty level, Village of Shadows added. <laughs> no. Following has been added to the bonuses menu, extra content shop, content art figures and challenges. Complete challenges listed in the challenge menu in order to receive completion points can be exchanged for provided bonuses. New game modes, weapons. Following moves have been added. Ooh, ooh. Excellent. Oh, I love it when they add in development videos. Sorry, I'm gushing now. Games that I enjoy, I like to see how they are put together. And I really wish more games companies did this. You know, you, you finish the game. I've enjoyed the crap out of it. Show me how it was made. Show me how, you know, the development, how it was put together. All of that kind of stuff. Visual production especially. Concept art, that kind of stuff. Level design even. And creating the Village of Shadows, which I assume is going to be the animatic. It's like, yes, give me more of that. You can now get the following weapon from the extra content shop for finishing the main story. 95,000 conquest points. Oh, so for actually oh, for getting a load of the achievements done, we've already got... Does it, does it tell me what these things do? Uh, let's save that over save one. Completed data saved. 
Right, let's take a quick look in the uh, the bonus shop. See what we've got. Challenges. Right, so these are... Village of Shadows, Crafter, Hobbyist, Craft 60 items. Oh, we were one off. One off. Uh, oh, quite a few off. That one. And that. Purchase something from Duke. Unlock 15 simple locks. You must have to do that on multiple playthroughs. Com complete all combinable treasures we did. We missed at least three fish, but there were clearly more than that. Join the story. I suppose you can do these over multiple playthroughs. Move the ball from the winter's bedroom into the study. Shoot down five flying crows. Got the outhouses. See, that's something that we could have done if we could have gone back to the castle. Got that, accidentally. Uh... Yeah, I saw that one. Defeat Uyas, join the first Lycan Assault. So he's the big guy with the hammer. Defeat 20 enemies with other enemies' attacks. Defeat a sound. See, I don't know what the names of the... Oh, we three away as well from that. 200 enemies with handguns, shotguns, sniper rifle. We need an infinite grenade launcher for that one. Did all right with that one, though. De oh, defeat mutated Dimitriscu in under 2 minutes 30 seconds. Defeat Angie. Who was Angie? Angie was the dot. So we, yeah. Mutated Moreau. In under a minute. I assume you have to do those on easy. Oh, we weren't far off that. Have 777 in your possession. Have 52911. Anniversary presents. Five, four, three, two, one. Eight million one hundred thousand. That's a specific number. Thirteen out of twenty. There were seven goats that we missed. Got a load of crafting stuff missing, including some crafting recipes. Apparently, oh, we missed some files. Defeat the story using only only using four less recovery items. Yeah, finish the story within three hours. <laughs> Spending less than 10,000. Using nothing but close combat weapons. Finish the story without moving items. Finish the story three times. That's mercenary stuff. You all character and weapon models. Well, we've got a lot of... Uh, what can we buy? New knife. An assault rifle. Ah, I need to fully upgrade everything to unlock the infinite ammo ones. But we can get infinite ammo for the shotgun. For 20,000, which might be worth it. You can also get it for the grenade launcher. <laughs> Steak Magnum. Oh, that's... Yes. 
Infinite ammo for the Dragoon Assault Rifle. Ah, but that's that's Chris's, isn't it? Character models. Oh, we've got to buy all these. Oh, that's how I can tell which of the, the different... Yeah, we can, we can unlock... Jeez, there's loads of stuff. Are these all figures? Yeah. Let's, let's actually... Oh, and we've got concept art as well. Is this the concept art that I've seen? No, this is different. No, I've seen some of this. Ew. Concept art from the picture book? Ooh. Mia's murder. Wow, there is lots and lots of stuff. Once obtained, pick it from the merchant in the main game. So the WCX is the assault rifle. Hmm. Anyway, I'm not going to do that now. Hundred and twenty pieces of concept art to unlock. That might take some time, but that has been Resident Evil Village. Very impressed. Very impressed and entertained. Really enjoyed that. There were some disgusting bits, there were some great bits, there were some heartfelt bits. They've clearly got a direction that they're moving in. I felt sorry for Ethan. I felt sorry for Mia and Rose. I felt sorry for Chris. I also felt quite sorry for Heisenberg. And I kind of felt sorry for the um, the three daughters as well, who it seems like they'd all been experimented on against their will. Obviously, it turned them crazy. But yeah, a really, really good experience. Super impressed with that um worth full price good chunk of game there obviously subsequent playthroughs will be quicker because i know where i'm going and i know what's going on now obviously there's a new game plus version uh game as well where you can probably do more bits and pieces but yeah resident evil village good stuff good stuff hope you have enjoyed this playthrough of the game and my thoughts and this and the other on the matter hopefully you'll join me again for another game series until then thank you once again for watching stay safe out there and uh cheerio